Hello everyone, and welcome to my Sister Wise For You channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Fans of Sister Wives are excited to see what will happen with the family as season 19 of the show draws near. It's clear that Cody Brown doesn't get along well with the majority of his grown children. Furthermore, he is continuously attempting to place blame for his bad deeds on other people, particularly David Woolley, Christine Brown's new partner. See the two men square off in the season 19 teaser by continuing to read. Season 19 teaser hints to dramatic events. There will be a lot of turmoil in the Brown family, according to the latest Sister Wives promo for season 19. Naturally, Cody Brown appears irate for a large portion of the video and even wonders himself at one point what he did to deserve all of this. It appears that he is ready to assign responsibility to anyone but himself. Christine Brown introduces her husband, David Woolley, at a different point in the video. He shows up during a family get-together attended by the majority of the Browns. While holding a newborn, Cody is seen glancing at David, who is seated in the corner with her daughter, Isabel Brown. Since he began dating his ex-wife, David Woolley and Cody Brown haven't exactly been best friends. He has occasionally tried his best to stir things up. In a humorous social media post, Cody made a remark about Christina eating nachos, which Christina and David made fun of. Fans of Sister Wives might remember that Cody wrote in the family book about how Christine's nachos grossed him out. Furthermore, David began referring to Christine as the queen in an attempt to irritate Cody. The intended irony is that Christine was called a princess and accused of being indolent by the patriarch of the Brown family. Will fans of Sister Wives witness Cody and David fighting? There isn't any conflict between the two men in the season 19 teaser. To be honest, it probably won't happen. If Sister Wives viewers are aware of anything about Cody Brown, it's that he probably won't talk trash until he has a confessional session. Nevertheless, David Woolley seems to make the whole Brown family feel comfortable. The children of Janelle and Christine Brown seem to get along well with David. Compared to when Robin Brown joined the family, they have been far more accepting of him. Fans might recall that Cody Brown began breaking his own rules one after another when Robin initially entered the scene. Not to add, when Christine went into labor, he was spending hours with Robin. At the start of the COVID-19 pandemic, the Sister Wise star established increasingly stringent guidelines that caused him to become even more estranged from his kids. After a while, only he and Robin departed. There's a big contrast for the kids between David's and Robin's introduction to the Brown family. Robin stated that she wanted a large family to grow old with, but her behavior never supported that assertion. She exerted every effort to transform the family dynamic and establish herself as Cody Brown's first priority. In contrast, David has accepted Christine Brown for who she is and the family as a whole. Cody appears to be furious that Robin, his favorite wife, is disregarded while 12 of the 18 children have welcomed David Woolley into the family. Supporters are aware that this is absurd, but Cody has never shown self-awareness and he will never accept accountability for anything. The well-known polygamist and his 45-year-old surviving wife, Robin, were highlighted in a recent teaser for the spin-off program. In one video, Cody could be heard reading aloud a fan's comment while gripping a tablet. I believe it's fantastic that you two have connected and simply want to spend time together. I believe you ought to acknowledge that and say so. Jeff, a fan, remarked to the pair. Cody, who was previously married to Christine, 51, Janelle, 54, and Mary, 52, turned to face the camera and angrily spoke at Jeff. Well, Jeff, I think you're a victim of 20 hours of our life versus 365 days, Cody replied. Robin interrupted the TSC star before he could continue his sentence, covering Cody's lips with both hands to silence him. You quit, he was being polite, she told her spouse. 
Robin was still looking irritated at Cody's remark when he said, Listen, we didn't want our family to fall apart. Is that not evident? Robin spoke up for the fan, stating, You're right, but he's not trying to be rude. Cody went on, You read too many tabloids, Jeff. I didn't want this breakup, and neither did we. Robin seemed to give up on the dispute after they exchanged points of view for a while. Listen, I've gone through three divorces in three years, Cody continued. I'm not content at camp. I'm also not very kind. Christine was the first of the polygamist family's members to leave after 25 years of a spiritual marriage. In November 2021, Christine and Cody called it quits, and Mary and Janelle soon after. With a statement posted on Instagram, the TV star said, After more than 25 years together, Cody and I have grown apart, and I have made the difficult decision to leave. Viewers recently witnessed the turbulent conclusion of Cody and Christine's relationship transpire on screen. Janelle departed the marriage almost a year following Christine's departure. Cody broke the news last year on the Sister Wives. One-on-one -on -one special. I'm separated from Janelle, and I'm divorced from Christine, he stated. Mary chose to part ways with Cody a few weeks later. The actress announced that, after 32 years together, she was ending the partnership at a Sister Wives special. A formal joint statement regarding their divorce, released on January 10, 2023, from Mary and Cody read as follows. After more than a decade of working on our relationship in our own unique ways, we have made the decision to permanently terminate our marriage relationship. The photo was captioned Merry Christmas Isle by Mary, 52. I'm wishing you a stunning and wonderful day spent with loved ones. The sister-wise actress was posing next to her Christmas tree in the photo, sporting a jumper that said, Merry Christmas, y'all. The TV personality's shot seemed to have been significantly edited, with the edges of her face washed off and facial characteristics smoothed over. One individual said, Wow, so much filter, in the comment area. One more reviewer said, I concur. Without the filter, she appears better. Extremely refined. Be yourself, a third person said. Why always with filter? Inquired a fourth commenter. A fifth person commented, Oh, the filters, and included an eye roll emoji. We are made in the image of God, said a sixth admirer. Filters not included. The conclusion that there were too many filters was disputed by other commenters, who wrote, You look great, Mary. Keep it up, and you look friggin' gorgeous, Mary. Following her divorce with Cody, many believe that Mary changed her last name after catching a hint. Mary posted a picture of a recent addition to her Christmas tree decor on her Instagram page. The reality TV celebrity took a picture of an ornament that was designed to resemble a postcard. One side of the ornament read, Merry Christmas, in huge writing. The words, Please bring me pink and white sparky countertops with rounded edges were written beneath it. And a new best friend, too. The signature read, Mary Caroline Davenport. After the Instagram story was posted, curious Redditors commented on it. Mayor has officially changed her last name from Brown, a person questioned. Mary Davenport is a really wonderful name. One more TLC fan complimented. Mary Brown is plain and meh. A third exclaimed, I agree. It fits her first name much better. Glad to see that Mary is deserving of being herself. She's been living alone for years now, so it's evident. Mary, I'm happy for you. I think it's because Mary hates pink, sparkly things and wanted that specific countertop for her converted shed slash clothing shop space at the inn that her gay bestie designed for her. Another commenter said, implying that the ornament was an inside joke between her and a pal. Thus, it's satirical. It seems that her friend Jen Sullivan, who made sporadic appearances on Sister Wives, gave her the ornament. Mary has not yet verified any changes, however, her Instagram handle still has the last name Brown. Rumors that the TV star may have found happiness with a new man are circulating at the same time as news of a possible name change.
After she was spotted cuddling up to a man in adorable pictures, rumors started to circulate. Following a weekend away with family, friends, and pets, Mary shared photos on social media. The most recent key man in her life, Blair Strubble, her friend and personal interior designer, accompanied her. The couple took several close-up selfies inside a cabin decorated for the holidays. The two were able to take a moment to pet several goats that were roaming the grounds outside their accommodation. What a fabulous weekend full of joy and magic. Mary captioned the photo. The love of everything Christmas that at Blair Metal 12 possesses just causes the magic to erupt. However, I just can't get enough of these goats. You just can't help but smile when you're around them, I tell you. They genuinely embody happiness. In the post, Mary also gave her pal a particular shout-out saying, I'm so happy to have you as one of my favorite sidekicks on this life trip. Definitely a fantastic weekend. Although their relationship doesn't seem particularly romantic, admirers were overjoyed to see Mary grinning. Someone said, I'm so happy your heart is finding contentment. To all of your loved ones, happy holidays. One more said, you look happy and it's well-deserved. What a difference it makes to be in the company of healthy, happy people that nurture you, instead of a toxic, depressing environment, a different person wrote. Although Mary, 54, and Cody, 54, announced their separation in January, the patriarch of the Brown family acknowledged that problems in their marriage had existed for seven years before. With Blair by her side, the single mother has been healing from her divorce in the months that have passed. One individual said, Wow, so much filter, in the comment area. One more reviewer said, I concur. Without the filter, she appears better. Extremely refined. Be yourself, a third person said. Why always with filter? Inquired a fourth commenter. A fifth person commented, Oh, the filters? and included an eye roll emoji. We are made in the image of God, said a sixth admirer. Filters not included. The conclusion that there were too many filters was disputed by other commenters, who wrote, You look great, Mary. Keep it up. And you look friggin' gorgeous, Mary. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.